I just got out of the bath and I um I don't know like all day I'm just feeling so sick I was just feeling so sick and I really 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 don't know what's going on so I boiled something on the stove I'll show it to you this is what I've been boiling on the stove oranges limes ginger and garlic i'm going to put my face over it for about 30 minutes because i know it looked gross on the outer rim but that was just the residue from the fruits with the water and i'm going to clear my sinuses i don't know i am feeling um you know sneezy and i don't want to take any chances so so here i am I am underneath the mixture that's the pot there and the same as you can see Whew. oh that's oh that's wrong that's going all up <laughs> in my nostrils it's kind of hard to talk while doing this so steam in the pot and I just don't want to get sick I honestly don't so this is how my face is I'm gonna get some light this is how my face is looking underneath I need to clean plants. Yeah. Okay. So, ooh, skin looking good though. Mmm. Yes. Anyway, I'm gonna go back underneath it. any one of you to do this if if you are feeling sick and you know it's not Toronto <laughs> but you know you still don't want to take any chances so I got my pot here got my oranges lemons ginger and garlic I don't have any other ingredients to put in it I would have put it in <clears throat> but I'm not taking any chances so I'm gonna be under here for like 20 more minutes and I'll let you know how I feel after. Uh -uh. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me, said the pig. Okay, guys, so I am underneath. I am in it. I'm gonna cover, I'm gonna cover up myself, but this is how it's looking in, basically in the pot. And honestly, I encourage anybody to do this because you don't want to take any chances with your health. I know that my immune system is not the strongest. And you know, we can't be out here, we can't be out here in these streets pretending. And I, I you know, uh, I haven't been sick in years, but I know how I used to be sick, like really bad, like flus and stuff like that. And so, if flus do me bad and colds do me bad, 
I don't want to chance anything else, you know? So, just decided to vlog my experience inside of this pot. And as you can see, I'm sweating. Let me put this down. It's much harder when you put it down. Because all the steam is coming directly into your nostrils and mouth. <clears throat> I feel like... I feel like it's breaking down my coal. I could feel like coal in my throat before this. And I just feel the need to like spit. But I'm going to be under here for another 15 minutes. See how it goes. I'll be back. Well, being underneath this, like, it feels good, but my throat is super cold. Like, it's cold. Like, my throat and my nostrils inside is super cold. Like, it's freezing. I don't know what, what that is caused by, but I don't know. I guess it's working. I'm going <coughs> to see what I say. Like, <coughs> the cold is coming up is coming off up from my throat and my chest so guys i definitely recommend that you do this for yourself find some type of citrus or teas or something like that and you know do this i'm gonna go back underneath for another 10 minutes no five minutes Sweating. Makes a good facial. Not too bad. I'm gonna try to get my face deeper in the water because it's like I wish I would like keep it underneath like something hot to keep it you know underneath like a hot burner or something but it's getting a little warm so I guess I gotta put my um face deeper in the pot because when I go like this it's much hotter okay guys so I'm gonna stop it was good um a nice amount of sweat came out <sighs> i wish i could stay longer i'm gonna do this mixture again and i'm gonna add a few more like ingredients to it to like boost it up a lot more but it was good and it's worth a try so anyways thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in another video